on guys it is the gym it is thursday june the 2nd 2016 uh, but i've got to make a stop over here first i've got to run in here to the dollar store real quick and get me a monster and i've got to get me some more pixie sticks to take on my creatine so sit tight i will be right back got that got me a monster uh, so I'm really running low on energy I hadn't slept real good the last couple days but I can't let the let being a little bit tired keep me from uh, getting my grind in so a little bit of extra boost on top of my NO explode to kind of give me that give me that drive that I need to finish this workout to go in there and get it strong so uh, let me pull out here to the store, get down here to the dollar store, and I will see y'all in a little while. Bye-bye. Alright guys, what's going on? Uh, I got settled in. I helped my wife go through her workout routine first, so I'm fixing to start getting ready to do mine. She's finishing up doing her some barbell shrugs right now. But yeah, like I said, uh, I'm very, very, very tired today. Not sleeping good the last couple days, so it's going to mean... I get a little bit of extra oomph in my inner explode today. So instead of mixing, mixing it with water, let's see. Yeah, instead of mixing my inner explode with water, I'm mixing it with this monster energy drink that gives some extra caffeine, extra B vitamins. Hopefully, this don't taste too terrible. Uh, zero Ultra White Monster and some fruit punch and Oaks Blood. Man, what's going on guys? We just got done with our workout and boy howdy, it was a good one. And I gotta tell you something, I know I, that uh, the the clip earlier with me mixing my energy drink got cut kind of short. I kind of, uh, my wife had to come in and ask me a question or whatever before she left the gym for the evening. Uh, but you guys got to see me pour it in and mix it and everything. And it, it, it tasted really, it tasted pretty good. And if you can tell by my mood, I'm still kind of hyped up on it. Uh, I, it, it kind of it made me feel the beta alanine tingles a little bit more than I usually do out of my NO explode, which you know I don't mind that stuff. I really don't mind. And of course, you know, monster drinks, all the energy drinks have you know have niacin in them. And well, so does NO explode. And I guess just that double shot of, of niacin. I mean, my I was on fire. I was lifting really. I was lifting really good. Heck, I added 20 pounds to my truck to my barbell shrugs today, and it was like no problem. So. And I fired through my ab workout, no problem. Uh, you know, and I'm still, I'm still busting with energy right now. So uh, we had a really good workout. I told my buddy here in a couple weeks what I, something I'm planning on doing. I'm gonna let you guys in on it too. Is I'm going to, uh, man, Bumpy Road. I'm going to set aside a day where I forego our regular, uh, our regular lifting session. And uh, all I'm going to do is squats and deadlifts and maybe bench press that day because I want to reassess where my strength is. So I want to pull the big three lifts and all I'm going to do is do those those three days and reassess where my strength is. And I'm going to, and I'm going to record those and uh, record those sessions, you know, edit those together and put those up there for you guys to see. Um, maybe not in a couple weeks. I may wait about three weeks. You know, I just started doing the band training. So I want to see, you know, how much that helps improve my strength and my speed off the floor. And, and uh and my power coming out of the bottom of some of these lifts uh how much how much that improves that so so there's that to look forward to uh, let's see what else oh let's see today i uh 
I purposely cut some of my calories and, and my carbs really short, you know, because I, I sort of do one of those uh, if it fits your macros type deal, you know, not necessarily to the extreme where I just eat whatever I want as long as it fits, but, you know, I have a, a list of specific clean foods that I eat and I, ch I stick to that, but if I, you know, if there's something that I want to snack on, I just want to treat myself because, you know, let's face it guys, you got to live life. You know, like like my boy Brady Nunez said uh, on his video today, don't ever let fitness overtake your life. So uh, I don't. If I want to treat myself, you know, I make a little bit of preparation during the day, and uh, you know, I'll chop some of my some of my carbs and my fats and stuff back a little bit earlier in the day with my food, so I can have a treat later. So I'm gonna go here to the house and have my uh, protein shake. I'm gonna cut the peanut butter out of the, out of it, which I normally have that in my post workout shake. So that's going to save me some calories and some fats as well. Uh, I'm going to do that, and I'm going to fix me my big, uh, my big chicken salad. You know, with my, with my chicken and my lettuce and guacamole and I'm not guacamole, avocados and tomatoes and all that stuff. And then uh, for dessert, I'm going to have me a mint chocolate chip Klondike bar because uh, they were on sale this past or this past week, and and uh, I got a pack of them. And so those are like you know on days where I feel like treating myself, I can do that. But guys, anyway, I'm pulling down my driveway right now. I'm fixing to get in here and get my grub on and watch some TV with my wife and hang out with her and, and everything. Uh, uh, let me see. My mother-in-law is here at the house. Yeah, they're out there in the yard talking. Anyway, uh, guys, just stay tuned to the channel for some more stuff. I hope you like what you've seen. Don't forget to click that thumbs up button down below. Um, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you hadn't subscribed already so you don't miss anything. Share this video with your gym buddies. And guys, go out, have you a good time, getting some good gains, and I'll talk to y'all later. Good night.